Good morning traders and welcome to the daily call today Friday the 21st of April. Uh, before I start for those of you who were at the Perth seminar last night it was great to see you great attendance as a good night out. Uh, we'll be next in Melbourne I'll give you the dates um, when I have them on hand it's probably around about six seven weeks away just a very quickly but uh, look uh, shout out to you guys well done and I uh, hope to see a lot of you uh, join us all right um, let's have a look what's happened in the markets yesterday uh, we had uh, CPI data from New Zealand come in that came in at 1.2 percent that was under the 1.5 uh, forecast and also we had the uh, USD unemployment claims the job numbers there at um, 245,000 jobs that was more than was predicted at 240 thousand jobs so that's pretty much all that's happened yesterday let's jump along and have a look at our chart of the day for this morning the chart that I'm looking at is the euro yen on a daily time scale and if you have a look at this particular one uh, there's been already a, a zone where the market has uh, acted as a resistance at this level we are there again okay so we're not sure as yet if it's going to just continue shooting up or if it'll actually give us the rebound so what I want to do is look for confirmation of a reversal I do have that confirmation already in the way of these two candles let me just zoom in so we can see it a little bit better okay and if I highlight them for you <clears throat> those two candles there we can see that it's an inside candle so the red one is inside the blue one okay so it's the, the highs are lower and the lows are, are higher than the blue one so it's an inside candle so what we do is at the break of that inside candle which is right about there then if we do break in the downward direction then that's it that's our trigger and we're in the market however if this market should go up and break the top of the inside candle well then you've got to come back cancel the order out and essentially nothing has happened so this is our chart of the day it's the euro yen let me zoom back out there so we can all see it properly the euro yen and what we're hoping is to break down and enter the trade and basically we would be sellers let's see what happens and how this one plays out euro yen on a daily time scale all right what's on the agenda for today's session we have at 5 15 p.m sydney time from europe the french flash manufacturing numbers the flash services number and the german um that's at 5 15 then at 5 30 the german flash manufacturing and services and then at 6 30 from the uk we have the manufacturing and flash services pmi number due out there the last bit of data happens just before midnight at 11 45 from the US and it's the flash manufacturing PMI numbers from the US so a lot of data in the last session of the week look out for that make sure you don't get caught in any trades that you don't want to be part of um, that pretty much wraps up for today guys as always please feel free to contact us if you do have any questions you can follow me on Twitter at chat effects for trade setups and breaking news most importantly hope you all have a fantastic trading day have a great weekend and I'll speak to you on Monday for the daily call Bye for now.